Despite mandated improvements in confined space entry procedures, accidents still occur. Hey, can you hear me? You okay? Supervisors may fail to see that employees comply with the organization's procedures for safe entry. Conditions may arise that were unanticipated during the preparation of the permit. Hazards may appear suddenly and without warning, or a space may be entered where the participants are unaware of or unwilling to comply with mandated procedures. When an accident occurs, properly trained attendants and emergency teams can respond quickly and safely. However, rescuers must not enter the space unless they are trained and equipped to do so and have taken appropriate precautions. This is the second program in a series called Confined Space Emergency and is entitled Confined Space and the First Responder. The program is designed to provide training for those who work as attendants in confined space entry, as well as fire and rescue units who may be first on the scene of a confined space emergency. <laughs> 